Hi guys, today's video will explain why I haven't been posting for a month, and there are many reasons as to why. As you know, Toilet Tower defense has been down, which explains my first video, but don't worry about it, because it has all been resolved. I hope to make videos with a guy called Flint, because I will be talking about Roblox, Roblox developing and games themselves, mostly TTD, so subscribe! First off, your main question will be what I have been doing, and to that I say I have been Roblox developing for Flint, because we came up with the amazing idea of Bathtub Tower Defense, which I will discuss in another video, but for now, let's play some TTD, because it has been a long time. Now let's discuss about why TTD got took down. It got taken down because of one reason, copyright, from Defootboom, because Telanthric, the owner, was using a trademarked idea, which marked the start of a really sad period of time, as we couldn't play an insane game, which had around 500 million visits, showing how much damage the taking down of the game caused. This was really bad, as various YouTubers couldn't create viral content for a whole month, including Tedwa Teddy, LT Crazy, Baney Blocks, Cinda and Flint himself. This is only a small portion of the YouTubers affected, but as you can see, this was huge damage to the game, and players resolved to playing other viral games like Ride a Bicycle, Anime Fighter Games, Simulators, and Blade Ball. Some people also played fakes like Bathtub Tower Defense, which stole assets from the original, causing backlash from fans. This game is really fun, and I am happy that it's back, however, I still think that the clones made during the ban time should be taken off of Roblox, due to going against the Roblox TOS, and the games weren't as good anyway. But this is the time I ask you to subscribe, because at 50k, I will apply to be a partner at TTD, sign units, and ask to be a dev, as I played a big part in Flint's game, however, it did not release, which is a topic I will discuss in another video, and give me game ideas! Anyway, it seems bugged a little, so I guess I can't sell my secret agent, which is sad, and I also noticed the health on Toilet City doesn't necessarily work, which is fine for now. However, it means I cannot spam my secret agent when things get bad. Also, did you notice my comrade left me, which is also sad? Oh well, I might as well die pretty soon, just gonna upgrade a few things. The game's going pretty well, but my units are not the best, because after all, I don't have the time to grind, as I develop, so I trade instead. This titan looking fine, and before you say, I only spend robux on game development, that's it. Hopefully when I am able to sign, I can get some sick offers, but that's for later. It's good to have the game back now! I am so hyped for the episodes 63, 64 and 65 updates, firstly because so much happened, but secondly because episodes after, I could try developing, but that's beside the point. As you probably know, many units are missing like the long hair toilet, most probably the general or sergeant or even colonel toilet, and in the background of episode 61, a speaker ship looking thing too, which could mean there could be another crate of a speaker, camera and TV ship, which you could buy with coins. They are also missing the TV woman and an endless mode, but it could happen. Also, I would give away, but I am broke, so maybe if we get to 15k I will give away something good. And yes, at 10k I will make a full on game, just comment game requests below, and feedback, because I wonder whether these methods are the best or not. Hopefully we get an insane number of subs, and comment exactly what challenges I should do, because this is just a filler video for why I wasn't uploading for a month, and Toilet Tower Defense coming back. Now, developing is a really good thing, and if you want tutorials, you can comment, or join my Discord server coming soon. Oh well, now we are done, let's look at these toilets! Oh no! We took a big hit, but at least we didn't die, which means we are in good hands, however we cannot take any more damage, or else we will die for sure. Since I am alone now, the damage and health of the toilets will remain as two times the amount, which is too much for me to handle, and I know for a fact that somehow the buzzsaw toilets will get through and I won't be playing anymore. Anyways, I am just happy the game is back, however I am always afraid to summon, mainly because when I do, I get the worst units and spend all the coins I have grinded for, which is pretty annoying I guess. Do you do the same? Comment below the answer, but if not, how do you get all the strength to spend all your coins you spend hours working hard on? That's pretty good. I am almost at $1,500, and I am wondering which to upgrade, the Titan Cameraman or the Camera Spider. I feel like the Titan, so let's do it! 
never mind, the spider can walk, the damage is the same anyways, so it really doesn't matter. What I am scared about is when a bunch of stunning units appear, because we don't have any healing units yet, which is scary. Why is this secret agent still here, and the city health is bugged? This game needs a lot of debugging you know. But it's fine I guess, however, I experienced the health glitch one or two weeks before the shutdown of the game due to copyright. No not again! That is a lot of boss toilets, I wonder how we will deal with it. And this playlist is fire not gonna lie. Anyways, I feel like I should invest in some kind of medic, and since I have the camera repair drone, I think I will use it, and I have come to know why it is better than the medic. It is a super rare thing in the game, like the third or fourth, and has an insanely large radius once max upgraded. And don't forget, he is the only unit in the entire game, so far, which can handle parasite toilets. I think that scientists are one of the best units in the game, for expensive yet good units which you need to max out. I think that Mr. Vacuum here should release Bob, and yes, I called my scientist Bob, which is not weird at all. Anyways, I am legit worried because this is an insane amount of vacuum toilets, in a bad way of course. Hopefully we can get them, because next waves will soon have the buzzsaw toilets and boss version 2.0 toilets, however I think I may have been wrong, as it has been a long time, one month to be specific, the game has been down for. Thanks for giving back Bob by the way. upgrading my units, however I sense the end coming soon, as we are struggling on these stunning mutant toilets. This is bad! I shouldn't have skipped too much, I won't be able to handle all of this, and skipping for barely any money at all. You know what, YOLO, I will skip until the end, unless it gets laggy or too out of hand, as I want some coins. Oh well! Bye! This is the end, and you know what to do, which is like and subscribe to the channel. These buzzsaw toilets have to be so fast, oh well, comment and until next time.